previously on visiting 48 counties in 48 hours. Thinking we're in Somerset. So, this is the sponsorship deal. Oh, yeah, right, yeah. sponsorship deal. We've not secured it. How yet. much are they paying you for this deal? Nothing, nothing, I don't know. Alright, it's free. After a quick service station stop, well, quickish, because it did take Danny quite a bit of time to walk up the stairs, which was a bit annoying considering our time constraints, eventually we headed back out onto the open road, with Danny navigating hard. 200 yards, bare right. Oxygen! Yeah! Woo! Hold on! Does that mean in the Himalayas? Yeah. Uh, is that enough? Yeah, that's that's more than enough, I mean. Arrived at our hotel number two. Disabled parking for you. Yes, ideal. So, we arrived in Peterborough had a hearty evening meal at the neighbouring beef eater and then we began setting up camp for the night. It's just basically making the spare bed. Do you want this? Um, me? No. <laughs> no. You got that, you can spoon that in your I just don't even know what it's useful for. Eventually we turned our attention back to the mission as the mammoth task ahead of us began to sink in. With morale slipping ever lower we decided to ring the third member of our team, Josh who is currently helping out on a work from home basis for a much needed motivational pep talk. I'd, I'd probably say, you know, you're not going to complete it, are you? So I'd say, no. you know, me, I'm quite health and safety conscious, which is, to be fair, why I didn't come on the trip in the first place. <laughs> um, well, you, did, you didn't think the health and safety protocol was up to standard? No. I, I think, Basically, uh, Josh, we need to cut to the chase here. What we're trying to say is, can you do a few counties for us tomorrow? Do, can you do a few counties for us tomorrow? Uh, Maybe you could do a bit of Lanky, <laughs> Lanky Mersey and <in> Cheshire. <laughs> <laughs> and if you could dip into West Yorkshire as well. Also, like, ideally you'd do Cumbria and Northumberland as well, just like a sort of nip into those. And while you're there, you might as well do Durham and turn and wear. You said you've always wanted to go to Newcastle. Yeah, you love Newcastle. If you could just box off the North East. <laughs> any time during the day. Any, any time before 7pm. Before 7pm. So That's it's brilliant because you get the light as well. After continued negotiations deep into the night, unfortunately Josh couldn't help us out with any of the counties, as he realised it was his uncle's friend's birthday party the next day. So day three was completely up to us. The next day. Okay, great. Well, that's it, yeah. yeah. There's not much more to say. Come on. Right. You can speed this up if it's gonna be real. I'll speed up the car. No, the footage. Oh, the footage, yeah. Say, low, low 60s, low 60s max. Danny just asked whether or not the car has cruise control, which I think he knows the answer to. That's the heating. This button, we don't know what it does, so potentially it could be cruise control. Flying through the southeast, we began to tick off the counties at an alarming rate. Hey, let's go, oh, fuck, yeah. Welcome to East Sussex. Hey. Kent! Yes! Yes! Garden of England! Woo! Clean this a bit for a better shot. Oh, perfect. That's looking much better. <laughs> much worse! <laughs> <laughs> Why is it not worse? <laughs> Just straight on for a while, yeah. M25? M25 North. Not south? No, no. no. That would be a fatal error. Yeah, yeah. Due to being under such severe time constraints, we had a very quick stop at a service station where unfortunately we encountered a minor safety issue. We couldn't close the boot. It's really hard to do. 2000 years later. 
All right, slow, slow, lower. No, I come back out, I reckon. As well as the open boot, we had also started to experience a few camera issues, which only added to our stress. It's just not the best footage in the world, is it? Really blurry. <laughs> Even our wild enthusiasm at seeing the county signs had started to wane. A six. A six. Yes, well done, buddy. As the day drew on, the motorways got longer and the jokes got worse. It's not more than worse. Yeah, actually, that's actually quite good at that one We soon started to realise that we may fail. In the end, the outcome of this trip was, on paper, a failure. I realised that this is an incredibly underwhelming end. Honest, yet yeah, underwhelming. However, we were two boys who visited 36 English counties in just 48 hours. And that is an achievement that no one can ever take away from us.